Hello everyone, today in this video we are going to learn how to find factors and prime factors of number 56. And for finding the factors there are two methods, one is the division method and the other one is the multiplication method. Here we will be using the division method and we will divide 56 by di different numbers and check whether 56 is fully divisible by that number or not. If 56 is fully divisible that means the number is a factor of number 56. So let's start by dividing 56 by number 1. So 56 divided by 1 is 56 and we got 0 remainder. So 1 is a factor of number 56. We get two factors from this division as 1 and 56. We are going to write the factors in pairs as 1 times 56 is 56. Next, we will divide 56 by number 2. So 2 times 2 is 4. And 1 is remainder. Then we will drop down 6. So this is 16. 2 times 8 is 16. So 2 is also a factor of 56. We got 2 factors as 2 and 28. So 2 times 28 is 56. Next, we will divide 56 by number 3. 3 times 1 is 3 and 2 is remainder. Then we will drop down 6. So this is 26 and 3 times 8 is 24. And we got 2 remainder. So 3 is not a factor of 56. Next, we will divide 56 by number 4. 4 times 1 is 4. And then we'll drop down 6. So 4 times 4 is 16. So 4 is a factor of 56. We got two factors as 4 and 14. 4 times 14 is 56. 56 is not fully divisible by number 5 nor by number 6. So let's divide 56 by number 7. So 7 times 8 is 56 and we got 0 remainder. So the two factors are 7 and 8. So 7 times 8 is 56. Next we will divide 56 by number 8 and 8 times 7 is 56. We got 0 remainder. So 8 is also a factor of 56. We got two factors as 8 times 7. But here we see that the factors are getting repeated. We already got 7 and 8 as factors in our previous division. So we will stop our division here. Now we will write the factors in increasing order as 1, 2, 4, 7, 8, 14, 28 and 56. These are all the factors of number 56. Now let's find the prime factors of 56. So prime factors are factors which are prime numbers. So let's make the factor tree for 56 here. So first we'll write 56 and we can write 56 as product of any of the two factors here. So let's take 2 times 28. As 2 is a prime number, so we are going to circle 2. And 28 can be written as the product of 2 times 14. As 2 is a prime number, so we are going to circle 2. And 14 can be written as the product of 2 times 7. Now we see we got 2 and 7. And 2 and 7 are both prime numbers, so we are going to circle both the numbers. So this completes our factor tree for number 56. All the circled numbers are the prime factors of number 56. So prime factors of 56 are 2, 2, 2 and 7. These are all the prime factors of 56. So by using these methods, you can find the factors and prime factors of any number. I hope this video is helpful to you. If you like the video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more math videos. Thanks for watching.